I always thought it would be fun to take some photos underwater. So I put it on my bucket list. And because I share this list with everyone, it's simply amazing to see the support I get from people that hear about my goals. And exactly this happened when I was in Cyprus. Oh. It's happening! Dude, what the fuck? <laughs> you brought everything! We're ready, man. We're ready. Let's go. So the plan for today is to do an underwater photo shooting because it's something that's on my bucket list and Stelios was like, yeah, we should make something happen on your bucket list. So that's the thing we're trying to do today. We're doing it. Yeah. It must be somewhere down here. Wow, oh, this is quite smooth. Yeah. <laughs> Wow, that's See, it's very even calmer pretty. than the morning, so oops. <laughs> oops, so that's good. Sand's going in a good lighting position, you might want to make it face that way. We'll see. Yeah, I think maybe photo from there. Yeah, yeah. But there's enough space to set everything up yeah. down there. Let's get going. Yeah, let's, let's get the goggles on and go into the water and set everything up. So Stelios even brought a tent and we're gonna set it up on here and then take it into the water. We definitely need some rocks to put on the tent and the stuff that we're gonna put underwater and also for us to like that we stay underwater we're just gonna carry a, a rock in our hand so we stay underwater. <laughs> In situations like this, I'm always wondering how many people have done that? How many people took a tent and threw it into the water? All right, they're gonna help Stelios setting up everything. Turns out that setting up a tent underwater is quite hard. <laughs> um, but I think even if it looks a little bit crappy, it's okay because I mean, it's underwater and it's okay if it looks silly. Well, basically we need a lot of rocks because those plastic chairs and plastic table, we need to keep it underwater somehow. I'm looking for big rocks. Trying to get the angle from like here. No, fell off. Oh. Yeah, let's try again. It's so wavy, makes it. Makes it really hard with all those waves. It takes a good one. Oh my god. Okay, let's try it together. Thank you. 
So you're gonna bring the box. Time for some uh, Greek uh, mythology over here. <laughs> so we're gonna read underwater. <laughs> yes. Well, let's just give it a try. Let's put the camera on time lapse so it takes a picture every half a second. And then, yeah. Oh, we, we're gonna do it without, right? Yeah. That's so even harder. Put the camera in and then yeah. We'll okay. Yeah, let's just put the camera down there. So, while camping, you're wearing a shirt. It's not like that you're at the beach, right? And also, because it's very hot when you camp, you need to wear a hat. Well, first attempt, yeah, not bad, but we have to move the chairs a little bit so you can actually see the tent. And also we're gonna remove the books because they just look weird. Like paper underwater, it's just not the same. How do you feel? Well, it's definitely more exhausting than I expected. <laughs> but uh, I yeah, I really hope those photos turn out good. And uh, even if they don't, I think it's accomplished. The bucket list goal number, I don't even know. The bucket list goal doing an underwater photo shooting. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Woo!